you don't understand what I mean by the title, I mean to make these type of thumbnails. And we are starting right now. Yes! The first step will be to find a suitable GIF. So go to your browser and then search for Aesthetic GIFs. Click on images and choose an image you like. I'll use this one. So right, right click on a note and click on open image in a new tab. And then go to the new tab then copy the image address over here you can use ctrl plus c to copy the address next open up a new tab and open up a new tab and then go to easygift.com i leave a link in the description below there click on resize and then paste the image id over here and then click on upload and then after it loads up click on this here and then change the width to 480 and the height to 360 and then click on resize image and wait for it to load and then after it loads right click on it then click on save image as save image as or wait we can just uh, copy the image address again and then click on crop over here and then paste the image address over here and then click on upload now the next step will be to uh, make will be to crop the the gif into five five to crop the gif into five parts because because it will be sh it will be showing up as five images over here. So the first thing change this to zero. Then change this to zero also, and then keep the width as ninety six. And change the height uh, height to 360. And click on set. Then click on crop image. As you can see, there is an image over here. Right click right click on it and give save images. Just to make sure that we remember about the which we we, re we remember which image are we saving right now. Give a suitable title such as. Uh, hand in water 1 and I click on save the next thing which you have to do is change this 0 to 96 and click on set and then click on crop image again and now we have another image right click on it Click on save image as and then keep the same title but change the 1 to 2 and next we change this 96 to 192 and click on set and then crop image now again right click save image as and again give the title as handy water 3 
Now for the next one, uh, change this to 288 and click on set and then click on crop image and then right click, click on save image as and again instead of 1, 4. And now the last one, change this to 3. 384 384 and I click on set and again click on crop image now again right click and click on save images and and change the 1 to 5 now we are ready with the gifs Now for the next step, I'll leave a link in the description below. Go to that link and it will take you to this site over here. Now drag this link into your bookmarks bar over here. And as you can see, it is added over here. Now this will help us to, ma to make our thumbnail appear as a GIF. Now for the next step. Right click on create and open a new tab. Do it five times. Now click on select image and then click on the first image that we had downloaded at that time. I mean the cropped one. Now wait for it to upload and then go to the next project and then click on select image. Again, but this time say, click on a second one. Then click on close. to share all our projects but make sure to share it in the right order go to your my stuff and click on the right click on the first image first i mean the first project and click on open link in a new tab and then the second one and then the third and the fourth and then the fifth Now wait for all to load. First one and click on share 
and then the second one and then the third and then the fourth and at last the fifth now if I go to my profile and see and there you have it Thank you for watching this video. If you used this tutorial, it would be nice of you if you credited me in the project that you wanted to share the GIF. You can check out my scratch profile linked in the description below and perhaps you will play some of my games and enjoy. If you like the video then like it. If you don't like it, like click on like anyways because it is fun clicking the like button. videos click on the right or the left video click on the middle button to go to my channel like always make sure to like subscribe and turn on notifications also wish you a very happy coding experience